I needed a tractor for the farm. What I have is um, the John Deere is more of a, a lawn tractor, and I've been beating the crap out of it during the past uh, year. So I needed something for the farm. I didn't want to put a lot of money into it. But I came upon this uh, uh, Cup Cadet. I think it's either 94 to 99. Uh, it's a 2000 series. And um, it was on let go. I got one 125 for it and brought my wife with me and uh, she talked the guy down easily to a uh, hundred and a hundred bucks and it's got the 18 horsepower Kohler engine V twin okay. look at it here there we go I have air cleaner for it guy said he put a new battery in it and it ran uh, last winter and what happened is he had an oil leak right here where the oil sensor was and I wasn't sure the right oil sensor didn't really match up for the year so uh, I started looking at some videos and uh, actually looking at a manual online the oil sensor is um, optional and what it is is it shows low oil pressure so some don't even have it and I checked the oil dipstick anyway so I put a plug in it right here that was wrong with it and it needs an eyelet pulley that's it um, oh then some um, valve stems inserts so that's about it it's uh, hydrostatic and it has a 48 inch deck and it's in pretty good shape it's only a thousand mile hours on it so um, now I'm going to change oil today, and hopefully um, it'll start up and charge the battery up, and it'll start up, and I'll be able to get it running. So I don't know much about this thing, but for a hundred bucks, I figured uh, if um, if it has more issues with it, I could easily get my money back on this, and probably make money on it. So. That's it. I don't know what else to say about it. It has uh, the original Cup Cadet tires on them. They're not weathered. And it's the one that has the drive shaft in it. So it's direct drive from the engine. Um, other than that, it's not, uh, not too much that I can say. I'll do a little bit of video on it later after I change oil and charge battery and see if I get it running. But um, until next time, thanks for watching.